How's it going, everybody? Arthur Reyes here with Winners and Winners, and today we're going to be talking about one football game on the Thursday night slate. But before we get into that, I want to talk to you guys quickly about a promotion we are running over at Winners and Winners, where you guys can get 60% off any premium package of your choosing. You're going to go to the description of this video down below, and there you are going to see that there is a link to bring you to my specific profile. You're going to click on the link, and you're going to see about 10 different options of packages that you guys can choose from, ranging from different prices, different sports that are covered, and the different length of time. You're going to click on whichever one works best for you, and you are going to use the promo code REY56TR50 for 60% off. You're not going to get that deal for long. It's a limited time offer, so take advantage of it. We also have our NBA betting guide. It's completely free in the description. It's amazing. A lot of man hours were put into it. So make sure to do that as the NBA season tips off. But today we're not talking about the NBA. We're talking about Thursday Night Football. Two teams that had a lot of high hopes going into the season and now are struggling. The New Orleans Saints will be taking on the Arizona Cardinals in State Farm Stadium on Thursday night. Both teams are entering 2-4. and four. The Saints are coming off a 30-26 home loss against the Cincinnati Bengals on Sunday, while the Arizona Cardinals are coming off of a 19-9 road loss against division rival Seattle Seahawks, and they are now on a two-game losing streak. Now, the Arizona Cardinals are a difficult team to look at. Obviously, you have Kyler Murray, but this offense has been decimated. James Conner is questionable, as well as Darrell Williams, but more on the receiving side. Marquise Brown is now potentially out with a foot injury that could be season-ending. You just They just traded for Robbie Anderson on Monday. I don't think he's going to be able to play on a Thursday night game, so that's going to be questionable. And then... This is going to be the return of DeAndre Hopkins from his six-game PED suspension. The Cardinals need a lot of offense. They have scored 26 points in their last two games. This offense has looked completely and utterly useless at times. But the Saints haven't been much better. They have Jameis Winston dealing with a myriad of injuries. Their team is underperforming as... Their defense that was supposed to be one of the better in the NFL are allowing 26.3 points per game. Again, we don't know about Jameis' health as he's been out the last few weeks. And this team has not looked good. They were supposed to be a good offensive team. Andy Dalton has been throwing decently. But really, he is dealing with a back injury now. And he is a nice veteran starter. But I don't really trust him to lead to a win. Now, this spread is not that different. It's favoring Arizona by one and a half points. But I do not trust Arizona enough to deal with, to cover the spread. There is too much volatility on this offense where you don't know what you're going to get out of DeAndre Hopkins in his first game back. Robbie Anderson, is he even going to be suiting up? I don't think he will. And they haven't come out and said if he is going to be on the roster and officially play. And if he does in limited snaps. I just don't trust Kyler enough to lead this team with a huge question mark around their offense. Give me New Orleans plus one and a half on the road on Thursday night. I'm not confident in this game. I'm not going to throw a lot of money on this. I think I'm going to just probably do around half a unit. But really, my bet for this game is going to be the New Orleans Saints plus one and a half. I think James is going to be healthy enough to play. If not, I still think that Andy Dalton will be able to move the chains against this Arizona defense that has not played well either. But that's all I have for you guys today. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you have not already. Tell me in the comment section below what you guys are doing with this Thursday night game. And I will see you guys in the next one.